Take Care is um, a film about a woman who comes home from the hospital after getting hit by a car, and she has a broken arm and a broken leg still, and she's going ho coming home to recuperate, but she realizes, she finds out that all the people who said that they were going to be there to take care of her really aren't going to be there to take care of her because no one wants to take you know care of anybody. So uh, she has to end up enlisting, forcing an ex-boyfriend to come and take care of her. And uh, hilarity ensues. Still, I look back and I think it's just a miracle that I got Leslie and Thomas Sadowski and all, all these great actors because, I, I mean, it's such a leap of faith for them to say yes to a film, even I an mean, indie film where there's really, in a way, it's kind of a lose-lose situation because there's a lot of risk, I mean, there's no money, and then there's a huge risk that the film really won't do well because many films don't do well, and they're the ones that kind of get the blame. Like, they're the ones sort of like out in front that gets the sort of heat if, it doesn't, if it's not received well. Um, or if they're not in good hands with a, a good director who's a first-time filmmaker. So, really, it's amazing that they took a, that leap. But basically, I really looked at a lot of different actors, you know, combing through casting lists and um, and just I Leslie and Tom both had these qualities of being, you know, incredibly appealing and charming people. So that even though the characters are sort of start out kind of unlikable you still want to root for them because the actors that I chose were very likable. So that was really unbelievably important. And I basically, I just, you know, I called, you know, I had a casting director and I called, for Leslie, I called her manager, John Carabino, who was so generous with me. And then for Tom, we, you know, talked to his agent. So, uh, and they just were so, you know, really very courageous to sort of be willing to sort of deal with me.